I don't think you gotta worry about not seeing Spider-Man here. Because you were gonna see Spider-Man here. Yes, it is. Question is, is the game coming out? No, no audio from Jake? Why is there no audio from Jake? That doesn't make sense. Because it's telling me I have audio for Jake. Let me check. Because that's ridiculous. Uh, okay. I think we have the... I think we have... Okay. Output. Audio. Come on. Okay. Okay. Cancel. The gear. Where's the gear, Jake? There it is. All right. Everything's... How's that? Test, test. Oh, I bet you I'm in now. I know this problem well. I know it well! <laughs> Some, Are we back? Uh, uh, Black Knight says your audio is too low, and I'm like, it's My not audio is low. low! It's not at all. It's not there at all. He's a little loud. Well, that's just Jake. Get so. your story together, everybody. All right. Jay, yeah, I was a silent pro tag for a second there. Honestly, I don't hate it. If I could somehow get through life just being like, like you know, I would. I think I would do it. I think I would take take the world up on that up on that offer. Okay, you're, um, you're still saying you're loud, but I think I fixed it. Okay, great. All right, we'll we'll see. Maybe we'll get some uh, some correspondence behind the Am scenes I as loud well. Or is Jake loud? That's the question I want to know. Chat. Are you quiet or am I loud? You know, right? Yeah, that's. I don't know. Volume sounds fine here, Marshall Williams. Says, All right, great, great. Uh. And how you are? Oh man! All right, I'm. I'm going to uh, let's. Joey may be quiet, says Tom. <laughs> I hate this. I'm. Yeah, it's okay. We'll. We'll get it all. We'll get it all. Uh, all sorted out. Wait, wait, uh, I'm turning my microphone gain up. Maybe that'll be better too. Okay, great. Yeah, great. Jake is loud. Jake wow, is this a is loud person. This is shocking because normally our problem is always that I'm too quiet and I'm trying to figure out how to fix that. And now, now the shoe is on, but the other toe. All right, uh, I turned you down in Discord. Let's see what happens there. Wait, Shane is killing me. Andre is quiet. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes I wonder if people actually watch Game Explain. <laughs> oh, this is good. Wait, do you think? I thought it was a joke. You think they thought I was Andre? They probably joke. They're probably joking. Oh, okay. okay. I Marshall says I can't hear Peter. <laughs> yeah. All right. I feel like people. Yeah. People are saying we're good now. People are. I think people are coming around. All right. Our, our, so, our, our QP4 production says he's bussing. So I like that. I don't really <laughs> know what it means, but I like it. Uh, this is great. All right. So hello, everybody. Welcome once again. We are, of course, getting ready here. Th thank you to chat. Thank you to really quick. Thank you to sweet, sweet chat. Yes. Always, uh, always being jolly helping us out, making sure that things are ready for the showcase. And of course, that's why we are we are here today, live streaming this event, the PlayStation Showcase. Uh, my hype is through the roof about mm. this. I'm, I'm, I'm a total believer that this is like going to be a big deal and we're not gonna get another one of these for maybe years. Like this is, this is going to be like, whatever that e3 was where it had like the last guardian and final fantasy 7 remake and all that, that was nonsense a legendary e3 that was like a too good yeah. to be true e3 for i have a question for uh yeah. Buchubu in the chat will you edit the first 20 seconds out of the video that was hilarious what which one are you referring to are you referring to the part where jake was just completely quiet or did I Dude, say that was, I was probably doing my whole intro too. I'm probably doing... <laughs> <laughs> it's awful. Dear God. All hear, right. Well, listen. we're all having a good time though. Oh, okay. Are you, are you, oh, you're, oh my God. Joey's listening to it right I'm now. I'm listening to but, it right now. Because uh, I said so, something I shouldn't have said. Oh, I told Andre to get his crap together, but I said a bad word. <laughs> Oops! <laughs> oh man! All right. Well. Uh, so anyway, the PlayStation Showcase. I think I want to know from chat what everybody wants to see today. I want. I want. I just want to see the flood of games and titles. I love looking at them, responding to them. So if there's something you want to see today, what what is on on your mind, in your heart? Let me see it in the chat, and I will be uh, pilfering through 
to see what everybody says, but I did my I did my tweet today. I did my summoning circle tweet for PlayStation All-Stars Battle Royale 2. We'll see if it makes an appearance, but we're getting some answers in from chat as we speak. Mini Maker wants to see GTA 6. Not gonna happen. Stop no, it. No, I don't think so either. That Rockstar thing, that does things on mind. their own terms. Yeah, yeah, Rockstar. man. GTA 6, I guess that's. I, for, I totally forgot about that game. We had that leak like last year. There was another it's, leak recently, working apparently. Yeah, there, they're some, working on I it. think somebody posted a video on Twitter of the game, too. So. I'm not, I don't know. I'm not that excited for it. I was, I was mixed on Red Dead Redemption 2. Like, it had a really good story and whatnot, but those controls were god awful. <laughs> it Joey, was not I'm not, fun to play. I'm, I'm right there with you. I'm not a rock star, man. I, I never like how their games feel, so it's always hard for me to, to get into them. And people love them so much, I always feel like I'm missing out. Uh, but hey, maybe GTA 6, maybe they'll do something that makes, makes me want to get on board. Uh, Clem Dill says metal gear solid three have you seen this rumor going around joey I have, metal gear solid 3? and i hope it's yeah, real yeah yeah i yeah so i i tend to think that maybe this is real i feel like we've been hearing about this for a while it feels like a lot of different different people that are kind of accredited are, are coming together to say that this is happening um i think this event makes sense it makes sense for this kind of event do we presume that this is unrelated to kojima that kojima is not involved in this sadly yes and i think that's, that's just the way it works now. i just want to i i part i want to see the remake just to see what it looks like i'm worried about the quality of it um because kojima is not involved so that's okay because we know if if konai was going to do anything it's always going to be without kojima and yeah. you know kojima has that flair that nobody else can replicate for better or mm -hmm. for worse so so yeah, yeah, I'm not, I'm not sure. Like, if it was maybe if it was just a straight up like visual remake, and they literally just put in the same exact like blocking mm -hmm. and camera angles, maybe I can see that work out. Assuming mm -hmm. this thing is even real, we're probably not even gonna see it here, Jake. But I don't know. It's been rumored for a while, so it's one of those like when there's smoke, there's fire. Yeah, um, you know, it's it's I know we've got Death Stranding 2 that was announced a while back so that we I mean, there's a Kojima presence in that way, but I kind of agree with you. I kind of think it this is just going to be a Konami solo venture and I'm not really sure about like, how do you make a remake for a game like Metal Gear Solid 3? How do you make that pop? Is it just better graphics or do they take like a kind of like Resident Evil 4 style approach and try to really make something for the modern gamer with modern gaming sensibilities? I don't know. I'm also not, I know nothing about, I, I am not a Metal Gear person. I don't know anything about this franchise. I played Phantom Pain, had a good time. Oh, that's that, all that's you it. need to play. Um, like, oh, great. Okay. I, I'm not sure because... I, I did play, th man, I've started with literally with Metal Gear, like the first, the very oh, okay. first cool. one, because yeah. I just wanted to get into this series. It came with the the Legacy Collection. I think it was called the Metal Gear Legacy Collection. Metal Gear yeah. Solid. Yeah, I'm trying to look at it on my bookshelf. Um, but yeah, it's, it's definitely a unique series. Um, three is canonically the first one, like timeline wise. Mm -hmm. So it's the very first, like in the in the series, like canonically. Good to know. Yeah, so that's why okay. a remake of three makes sense. Um, even then, like you should still play the games like of uh, the order they were released, because you know it keeps in mind that these sure. games came out like the here, here, and here. Three is three is arguably arguably the best one. That's like the common consensus among everyone. Oh. I have not played. I played every Metal Gear game once, so I, mm -hmm. I need to like go back and play some of them too but what was impressive about Metal Gear Solid 5 was that 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 engine it was running on the Fox engine it, it looked like a PS5 game on a PS4 pretty yeah, much yeah that game slapped I love I just loved the the loop of like going out on a stealth mission I felt like they cut all the nonsense out every time I started up a mission I was it was just like a little puzzle sneaking around doing your nonsense like, yeah, it, man, that was just such a fun game to play. Yeah, give me uh, those Metal Gear Solid 5 controls in a 3 remake. That's what I think. Mm, I think that's, cool. that should be, like, the most of their modern gaming sensibilities. It would be one thing if they, like, kept the dialogue from the freaking PS2, and it sounded like a PS2 game, but it looked like a oh. PS5 game. Probably not going to happen. But, um, right. 
but yeah, like it's it would be a challenge to make a remake of Metal Gear Solid uh, 3 or just any Metal Gear Solid game, really. I feel like Metal Gear Solid 1 was the remake that uh, was really rumored mm-hmm. a lot. I know Blue Point, the, the developers of Demon Souls, the remake, and the Shadow of the Colossus remake were rumored to be working on that, but I don't know. I mean, I'm. Oh, I, I know what they're working on. They're working on Uncharted. No, they're not. Stop it. Yeah, they're working on Uncharted. They already did the remasters, too. I know. They got experience. <laughs> they got... Didn't they do the Vita game? They did. No. Did they? Or maybe. was that Bend Studio? Oh, no, you're right. I think that... W- Ooh, I don't know. Maybe Chad knows. But, uh, all right. So, Metal Gear. Uh, we've also got from chat, uh, Special Edition Tactician says, I want something Persona-related, but it's not happening. Nope. I don't know. Are you, oh, I don't know, really? You say get no? Persona Five dancing all night or something, whatever. <laughs> yeah, I, that's that's kind of what I'm feeling too. I'm feeling like there is a possibility of a Persona Five spinoff. Um, there have been rumors of a Persona Three remake, and I tend to think that those are that those rumors are probably true, just because I, I, it makes sense in my head canon of w- what Atlas is trying to do with those characters in that franchise. Um, I, I don't know if that necessarily would show up here, but uh, Persona 5 and PlayStation, I feel like their identities are pretty linked together, so I could see something like that happening. Uh, Joey, do you care about Persona? Are you a Persona player, appreciator? No. no. I got I downloaded 5 on Game Pass, but I haven't touched it. I also know oh. I'm probably not going to have the, any time in the world to play that, so. Sure. sure. Yeah, I mean, it's not, a, not that I don't yeah. have time in the world, but, you know, the game time I do have, I just want to play, play, play. I don't want to watch cutscenes, and I know, like, those games are text heavy. Yeah. Oh, man. I love those games. Dear God. One Some critical uh, Jake gaming lore is being in college on my PlayStation Vita playing Persona 4 Golden late at night, staying up late, like, like in my bed like a child playing Persona 4 on my Vita. Time of my life. One of my favorite gaming experiences of all time. Uh, Beer Diz wants the Final Fantasy 16 demo. First I'm hearing of a demo. Uh, Square loves their demos. They though. do. They so really I could see do. this. I, I I feel like I could actually see this happening. Uh, Final Fantasy 16. I'm super excited for it. Leaning into the kind of combat stuff that I really liked from Final Fantasy 7 Remake. Totally the direction I want the franchise to go in. Where are you with this? Uh, I, I I agree with you there. Um, yeah. Final Fantasy is not a game series that I'm like in love with. Uh, mm-hmm. I did play all of the remake, Final Fantasy 7 Remake, just because I'm like okay. I, it, it's not going to take me that long because it's a 40 hour game, right? So I decided to do it. I did turn the difficulty down to easy during that final section, though, because I'm like, I'm not messing with this. Just tell me nice. where the story's going. Um, yeah. uh, final Fantasy 15, I played some of. I don't know how yeah. far I got into it. I feel like I got a pretty far amount in there, but I didn't finish it. I know how it ends anyway, so I'm kind of just like, eh, well, what's the point? Um, but 16, I might be interested in, especially since it's, uh, it's taking a more action uh, approach. And I, mm-hmm. from what I understand, they got the combat designer from DMC5 for it. So that's really right. interesting and different. I also want to point out a comment, if, two comments from my friend in the chat, Vanilla Soup, who is the number one Jake fan in the world, saying, Jake Lore, Jake Lore. Because you were talking about your, um, your what's it called? Your history with Persona. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's that's fan, dude. Vanilla Soup, number one Jake fan. I love yes. to hear it. Jake, oh, I see the comment on Jake Lord. <laughs> one day we'll do a Jake Lore stream. God, it would yes. take weeks. And then he also oh, said, man. "You do not expect to see Spotter Man today." To dat. <laughs> I love no how he, spo- no Spotter Man. I, I love how he corrected his spelling for today, but not Spotter Man. <laughs> uh, we've got uh. Who is it? Raphael Sorrell in the chat says, how about Kingdom Hearts 4? Completely forgot about this. Man, I would be out of this seat if Kingdom <laughs> Hearts 4 shows up at this. That would I would get so excited for Kingdom Hearts 4. I mean, it's likely, oh. but I feel like uh, Square Enix wants to like save that for their own presentations. Um, I mean, Kingdom mm. Hearts 3, the last time I remember that being at a PlayStation showcase was during a... Uh, was during their E3 2013 one where they announced it. Uh, I could be wrong, and it's totally been in other PlayStation showcases or PlayStation like press conferences. I actually think in E3 2018 they showed like the same Kingdom Hearts 3 trailer 
at the Xbox and the PlayStation press yes, conference. Yes, yes, and there was that weird thing with the music and the sound effects. Remember that? I do. There was no, there was no sound effects, but you heard characters go. Ugh. Yes. Oh, yeah, it was Ugh. awesome. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love Kingdom Hearts. Jesus. Uh, I just in my head the way that the King the next the, when when we see Kingdom Hearts four when we see it next they will have like an accompanying Disney World that they reveal it alongside and in my head you it's it's Star Wars in my head it's like you oh. hear the lightsaber oh, you know what yeah, I mean that would be so good yeah. lightsaber Keyblade James. yeah exactly like it's exciting hasn't that isn't there an image they showed of Kingdom Hearts where you could see like the foot of an at at or something okay I remember that going around I don't buy it but I <laughs> but I know what you're talking about and that would be that would rip that would be extremely exciting I was hoping oh, man. for okay. in Kingdom Hearts 3, but that didn't happen at all. I know, me too, me too. I feel like they're always behind, you know what I mean? It like Because the games are in development for so long, yeah. it's like, oh, Tangled in Kingdom Hearts 3, even though that's like old news by now. And you know, Their so, most recent but, one yeah. was Big Hero E-Track, the song, the licensed song in Big Hero 6. Do you, do you remember? Was it Immortals by Fall Out Boy? Yes! <laughs> Give me him more! Dude, it's so good. I, I was, off I was that, more yeah. of a fan of Centuries, but that wasn't in the movie. Um, yeah, it was, sometimes I think it is, though. Similar songs. They came out like the same like uh, time span, so I, yeah. I, I totally get that. Yeah, Marvel Star... Oh, Jacob in the chat says, Marvel, Star Wars, Indiana Jones, or even The Simpsons. Man, that'd be... Ooh, I could see Indiana Simpsons. Jones... Or Simpsons, yeah. I could see Indiana Jones just because they they have the the hyper realism with Pirates of the Caribbean, which I always oh yeah you're right so funny to me yeah that would tra that would translate I see that I know that Xbox has that exclusive Indiana Jones game so oh I'm not my sure god I don't want to talk about Xbox too much but like I'll save that for the Xbox predictions but I hope we see that next month at the showcase there oh okay gotcha gotcha yeah. um. There was, wait, there was another good, there was a comment in the chat I wanted to respond to. Now I lost. Oh, okay. Marco in the chat. Super Smash PlayStation. Listen, listen. <laughs> if somebody, if somebody brings it up, I'm going to talk about it. And play, I, I was really hardcore reflecting on PlayStation All-Stars today. That game was so ahead of its time. It, it managed to be a much better game than it should have been with a you know, scrapped together development team, having to support with cross-play uh, the PlayStation Vita and the PS3. That was one of those games. And this game, the PlayStation All-Stars came out before the glow-up, before the PlayStation brand glow-up. You know what I mean? There's yeah. no... There's no The Last of Us in the PlayStation All-Stars universe. That doesn't... That's right. There she is. Uh, and now, dude, oh my god, this this the power vacuum that exists... For a smash like fighting game i feel like it's real somebody has to get in there grab that power make us go nintendo who you know it's funny <laughs> joey we did our we did our predictions for this and i got some comments in there i was looking at the comments as i do and some people were like oh my god these nintendo fanboys which is hilarious to me yeah. because i feel like in truth if anything i'm a total sony pony if i'm being <laughs> honest if i'm being honest i think <laughs> Yeah, that, I, I saw oh, those comments too, and I'm like, that's ridiculous. Like, you clearly yeah. didn't listen to the show, like, the, our predictions at all, like, thinking we're just only Nintendo biased. Like, come on, dude. No. Like, get a lot real. of hype here. Love PlayStation, dude. Come on. You and me, how hyped are we for Spider Man 2? Uh, I, I, I can't give a number yet. I don't think I've seen enough oh, okay. to get excited, to be honest. It's not real yet. It's, it's not, not real. real to me yet. Exactly. Yeah. And I don't know, Jake, they're reusing the same world as Spider-Man 1, so can I... I'm just kidding. I'm making fun of it's myself. It's just DLC. Yeah, it's just $70 it's... DLC, Jake. I'm just making yeah. fun of... I make For one, I'm making fun of myself, because I said that about Tears of the Kingdom. I just beat right. that game yesterday. 10 out of 10. Not really 10 out of 10, but it's like, oh, man, it's so good. I love it so much. But uh, Nintendon in the chat says, any particular PSVR 2 things you are hoping for? Yes, Half-Life Alex, please. Yes. Yeah. And then I think yours, Jake, is Astrobot. Mine is God of War. Oh, that's right. God of War VR. Yeah, I want God of War VR. I want to look down and go, poof, poof. Oh, you know, throw <laughs> my axe and do some nonsense. I want to, yeah, I feel like, well, and it doesn't have to be God of War. Like, if it's Ratchet and Clank, I'm down. Like, I, I want to see the next Horizon Call of the Mountain. I want them to keep 
putting out these little bread crumbs of first party Sony PlayStation VR experiences. I loved Call of the Mountain. Really loved it. So if if I could get something else that's kind of on that level in the VR space, especially with a PlayStation brand, a character that I care more about or a world than the world of Horizon, which I'm kind of like lukewarm on, if I'm being honest. Yeah. Uh, then that would absolutely rip. But really quick, I need to address my rigatoni in the chat. Let's hash this out. We have 10 minutes until this presentation goes live. My rigatoni in the chat says, bro, love you guys. Love you too, my rigatoni. But you're both super biased. What does that mean? I don't get How? it. How? How are we biased? How About are we? what? For who? Hey, listen. If PlayStation wants to put some dollars in my pocket, please. But they're not. So I've got <laughs> Or is it that I'm biased for Nintendo? I don't know. I don't know. But I want to get to the bottom of this. I don't know either. But how's our audio doing, chat? Because I got some comments about audio clipping, which I don't know what that is. But, like, are you saying we're peaking or something? I'm not sure what's going on. Um, but I think I think it's subsided. I haven't seen any more comments about it recently. Oscar Rio says, love you, Joey and Jake. Oh, I love you, too. Oh, you, thank Oscar. you, Oscar. Thank you. I mean, yes. Even though, even though we're super biased. Yeah, we're super. Even though <laughs> okay, it says we're better now. Okay, cool. You know what? Uh, Joey sounds right. like trash, but that's just his voice. Hey, vanilla soup. <laughs> like, <laughs> screw you. <laughs> Is that an offensive thing I just did? I didn't want to do the middle finger, but whatever. I thought that was. <laughs> okay, that was no, fine. we wait. We we sold my rigatoni. He says he says love you too, Jake. Okay, I'll take your word for it. Yes, He's, we, we sold, sold it. Him. We got him. Okay, so we're not... There you go. We're not biased. Listen. All right. And... We, um, yeah. Okay. Um, what were you going to say, Jake, before I get to talking about Bloodborne? Because we forgot to talk, talk about... Talk about in our Bloodborne. I'd love to hear about okay, Bloodborne. Okay. We didn't talk about it in our predictions, which I thought was mm. weird, because I, I could have sworn we we would have talked about it, but we just didn't. Um, yeah. Uh, I don't know. I really don't know anymore. <laughs> Do you... Are sorry, you a Bloodborne can, Sorry, Vanilla Soup. Sorry I didn't give you that middle finger. Um... What's it called? Yeah, I do like Bloodborne a lot. I really okay. like Bloodborne. I never beat it, though. The only Souls game I ever beat was mm. Elden Ring. And then I went back to Bloodborne for a bit, and I was thinking, I need the remake. Or I need the, or I need a PS5 patch. I need a PC port something. Because it's, it's shocking, for one, that this never got a PS4 Pro patch. And it's even more shocking that it didn't get, hasn't got one on PS5 yet. So... It, they got to do something. They Sony has to he hear the Bloodborne fans right now. Mm -hmm. They have to. Like, they got to do something with Bloodborne. Because, like, yeah, it's not an impossible game to revisit at all. It's still a very much playable game. But there's frame pacing issues. Um, right. It would just be nice to play this game at 60 FPS. And Listen, that's saying something. We've got, we already know the best place for Bloodborne in 2023. Where? And that's as a as a character in PlayStation All Stars <laughs> 2. That would be. <laughs> yeah, what would his name be? Just Bloodborne guy. The hunter. Just the hunter? hunter. Yeah, Bloodborne hunter? guy. Yeah. It's a custom creator. I um, feel like you could do a character called the Hunter like three different ways. It could be the Bloodborne Hunter. Oh, Joey, are you gone? I'm okay. I'm you're back, back, and my cat just opened the door behind me. Okay. Uh, there, you could do Bloodborne Hunter. You could do the Destiny Hunter. Destiny, of course. Now, uh, Bungie. You know, that's all PlayStation's business now. So get him in there. And I think there's another Hunter. I'm not. Oh, Monster Hunter. Monster Hunter. Yes. There you go. There's your three Hunters. Oh, Vanilla Soup said Final Fantasy today. Um, you know, I've seen enough. Like, there was a preview that just came out, like, two days ago, maybe. Like, all the outlets posted their previews for this game. And just you know show us stuff we don't know sony like i, I yeah. wouldn't be surprised if final fantasy 16 shows up here but i'm done i'm ready for yeah. the new stuff yeah. right now i mean we have an hour we have an hour which is such a long time um so i feel like we probably will see final fantasy but joey i'm i'm kind of uh oh he's, he's okay wait hold on a second oh yeah it's, uh, joey i'm on your side i feel like uh, we're, we probably will see Final Fantasy just because this is an hour-long presentation. But um, I, I'm kind of like, man, if they spend too long on Final Fantasy, if they do a gameplay demo, if somebody's playing it, uh, that'll be such a bummer. Oh, That's not, a we don't break. we don't need that right now. Give me yeah. one second. I'm gonna put a door stop on my door so my cat doesn't break in again. Oh, excellent. Please, I'll entertain the chat. So, chat, here's the other thing I want to see that nobody's talking about: Ratchet and Clank. I love Ratchet and Clank. Probably one of my favorite video game franchises of all time, I would say. Definitely in the top 10. I'm talking about Ratchet and Clank. Oh yeah. And 
if it could if it showed i my expectation for this presentation is that it won't be here uh simply because i've heard no buzz of ratchet and clank and i feel like insomniac has enough going on so i'm not expecting it but if 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 ratchet pops his sweet little head up at any point in this i'm going to be extremely pleased you know what i'd love jake i'd love a collection a ratchet and clank collection of the ps3 games because oh yes that would be Sony awesome needs to do something about their ps3 library that's just ridiculous that we can't play like any of this on ps5 without having to subscribe to ps plus and play it on the cloud get out of here with that get out of I here gotta with tell the you, cloud. i've i've like played those games too that way it, no no just no. no like if you we're if, not there if if i see anything cloud related and he's not in final fantasy anything i throw up like cloud editions oh. can just burn just burn joey i hate i hate to tell you this during this presentation they will talk about the cloud i will turn this stream off if they do <laughs> uh we got a super chat thank you so much born 96 it's jason born jake he's in the chat oh it went to black stay tuned oh my gosh oh it's happening it's happening wow cool okay so uh some kind of collection he says like sly ratchet or jack exactly what i was just saying like give us collections the fact that i can play hd ports of jack and daxter on my ps3 but not my ps5 or ps4 is ridiculous right like the ps3 yeah, it, had a it, lot of collections what happened it's yeah it's kind of funny that the collection has fallen out of vogue where there was a time in which everybody was like yo we are overloaded on hd collections this is too much we're sick of it and now it's kind of like all right we're gonna do them very specifically for i mean like you know that remaster is rumored for horizon zero dot oh my god and that like oh my god we we never got there is no real way to like play infamous one and two on ps5 without streaming them that stinks that stinks yeah. i would love to play those games right for a remaster we got a super chat from monster society Ooh. thank you so much saying we need more pc ports please sony oh you'll get your oh. pc ports i don't know about here oh. but you'll get i think i think ratchet actually might be the one it might be for due, today. it's due for one it's due for yeah one. it's been two years is it really yeah. been two years gosh crazy yeah Oh, I love that game. Yeah, it's a good one. I played it, and then I immediately forgot about it. I don't know. There's something about it that just didn't, like, stick with me. Like, it was still mm. really good, and I enjoyed it. But I wouldn't say I'm, like, going to remember this game for all time, right? But it was still, yeah. like, a really good one. But um, I agree. Yeah. Uh, yeah. It was good. I, I, it, like, it almost, like, wasn't special enough. Mm -hmm. It, You know what I mean? It's, like, I feel like the, uh, the big thing it had going for it as, like, an advertising point would jump it through the rifts. And you you can only get so excited by low loading times. Like yes. it's obviously that's great, but it's not like you're sitting there playing the game going, "Whoa, doggy, that was fast!" You know, like <laughs> seriously. And it wasn't even right. that impressive a mechanic, honestly. It was yeah, only used it was for like some traversal sections, but yeah, that was agreed. it. So, um, I uh, Connell Mc McOwn said said i bet they'll talk about the gran turismo movie please stop talking about that movie i don't care <laughs> will, will playstation studios speak that's a that's an interesting question i kind of think be. man i kind of think no i think they're i think they might play their cards right and yeah. not do that today just but, give us they said games five and psvr2 games that's what they said yeah that's true Oh, speaking yeah. of PSVR 2, you mean, thank you for the super chat saying, give me some PSVR 2 as good as Wanderer on PSVR. I've never even cool. heard of this game. Have you played it or heard of it? Wanderer? No, I don't know what that is either. Interesting. I'll have to take, I'll have to, excuse me. I'll have to uh, check that out. One minute left, dude. Is it really All right, that one long? minute left. We're in our final 60 seconds. I'm so curious about how they're going to start this up. Will we go right into a game? Will somebody speak? It's going to start know. with some weird live action advert like the last showcase did. Bet. Oh, that's a great bet. Wow. Yeah, I think you're right. It and is going to be Jim a weird Ryan's going to talk. <laughs> I remember that one, the heist. Yes. Uh, wait, Joey, will Knack reveal himself? I hope so. God, I hope so. Cool. Knack five. <laughs> you, every time you mention it, you, every time you mention an act sequel, your number goes up. <laughs> that was an in joke. And I was an in joke. <laughs> oh man! Stay tuned. Uh, it's happening. It's one o'clock on my end. 
All right, vanilla. Yep. Bye, chat. Party time. Vanilla soup. Okay. Here we go. Oh, I'm so excited. Yes. Let me know when it starts for you, so <laughs> you know, like, if I'm behind or you're behind. Oh, sure, 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 sure. Hopefully, we're not behind like too much. Yeah, yours like turned over, like, like right when mine did, so we're probably fine. Okay, good. Um, Do we know how long this is? Asks Lucas. Yeah, it's supposed to be an hour long. Mm, buddy. Mm, buddy. Can't wait. Okay, here's my guess. First thing. Uh, the Last of Us multiplayer. That's the first game that we focus on. Yeah, that's a, that's not a one more thing. Don't make it a one more thing. Please don't. Definitely make it not. Thing. No. If anything, Spider Man is probably the one more thing. But I don't like it when they, like, I want the one more thing to be a big surprise we don't know about. I think it will be. I think this showcase has surprises and they will save one for the end. Spider Man, I envision as the mid show. Yeah. 30 minutes in. Absolutely. Get the hype back up. Yeah. Uh, yeah. You want Mario Galaxy 3, Ultra Lord? You're going to have to wait a while. On PlayStation? I don't know. We could do it. We could get <laughs> Halo Infinite 2, let's go. Now y'all just being ridiculous. I like it. No, I like it. I like <laughs> the energy of this chat today. Uh, okay, they're um, they're one minute late. So oh, no. I hope I hope the PlayStation chat is getting doomed. spammed. Okay, it's fading to black. I... The ratings okay, are yep. up. Yep. Oh, okay, great. What is this? This program contains mature content. Oh, okay. Sorry, chat. We gotta go. I'm not mature yeah, enough. Shut it down. Shut it down. <laughs> Okay, it's an advert, totally. I think it's a live action advert. I hope it's live action. Yes, it oh. is. PlayStation Studios? Let's see. Let me know how the volume sounds, chat. If it needs to, if you want the presentation higher or lower, just let me know. Okay. Cinematic trailer. Ooh, early announcement. Who's Haven? What'd they do? I don't know. Quick, somebody enter that code in their PS5. It's <laughs> simple. <laughs> Too Joey, what's on your screen right now? Billionaires. Got okay. And it's only getting worse. All right. Higher for the volume. Yeah, it's quiet. So, we decided to do something about it. Is this Watch Dogs 4 or something? It's some kind of like hero shooter type thing, you know? Multiplayer. Oh, it's Sony's live service. Remember, they said they want to do live service games. Yeah. Payday 3, maybe? Ooh, great guess. Probably not. I don't know. Just have that signature, like, mask, dude. Do you still want the presentation volume up? Or, because I feel like it's loud enough. Probably not. The volume's good, okay. Joey, I don't know if you need to know this or not, but I'm but I just checked and on Twitch the presentation is like a full minute and a half ahead. Alright, well too late now. Okay. Twitch is always ahead, but it's like yeah. fair game. Z okay. It's one way to start a conference, I guess. Oh, Tom Haven. says Haven is the studio with Jade Raymond. Cool. Oh, okay. Jade Raymond, she's a big deal. Is this just the transitions they're gonna keep doing? I think so. Hi everyone, I'm Jim Ryan, oh, president hi, Jim. and CEO of uh, Sony. Jim, bring out Knack. I'm delighted. Knack six, here come today on. To introduce what's next for PlayStation Five. Vanilla Soup We're wants now a new handheld. We're now third year of the life cycle of PS Five, and we've been fortunate to have so many fan favorite titles released on the platform. Jake, I miss What's Sean even more Layden. exciting is the developers- The way he's talking, I don't think anybody else is going to talk. I feel like this is just for the beginning, because the way he's in like this weird studio. Today, you'll get a glimpse into some of the most breathtaking and imaginative content that will be coming to PS5 and PlayStation VR 2. And now, what you've all been waiting for. Enjoy the show. Yes, what we've all been waiting for. Okay. Max 7. <laughs> Love it when they start with that PlayStation Studios logo. Super Earth, our home, our way of life. 
but freedom doesn't come free. The look on that guy's face. Oh man, you know what this is, Jake? What? Starship Troopers. It's gotta be. Look familiar. Oh. Scenes like Oh no, Joey, it's Helldivers. It's the, the new it's the, the right rumored now. Helldivers game. And you could I don't know what Helldivers next. is. Remember the, the little like Unless multiplayer like isometric shooting thing? It was so much fun. I loved it. Prove to yourself that you have the strength and the courage yo, to be Yo, Helldivers free. though. Join the Helldivers. Okay. Nice. Okay. It looks like a Starship Troopers ad cuz like it was all fun and stuff. Oh my god, dude, my hype. Experience true freedom. Oh, so they've changed it. It's got this like normal third person perspective now. The freedom to travel the galaxy. <laughs> Vanilla Soup said and ODST of the Bob. resources we need to build a better tomorrow. The freedom to encounter I'm a little disappointed it doesn't have it's and not the isometric style cuz I really like that to be honest. This looks great. The freedom to make new friends Aww. and represent the best of what Super Earth has to offer. Become part of an elite peacekeeping force and work together to spread prosperity, liberty, and democracy. Great start. Become part of something larger than yourself. Become a hero. When yeah, Tom. Exactly. Become game. a legend. Oh, was it was years, many years. It was nice. It's like way back on PS4. Becoming a Helldiver may result in decapitation or morbid occasion. Nice. Not all Helldivers survive. Helldivers, I, I. Okay, strong start, like you said. Yeah, I'm, I'm all about it. What's next? Sir? Okay. It's the what is this? I think this is Follow. Immortals of Avium. Yeah, it's Immortals of Avium. Oh, cool. This game looks dope. A little. I hope it's good. I always want games like this to be good, but they, they haven't panned out in the past. Yeah. Apparently this game's like a big deal because it's using Unreal Engine 5 and like it's still like in its infancy and a lot of games use it. Gotcha. And Kirkin seems to think you might not get me killed. Jury's still out on that one. I just hope that the mm. PS5 runs this game in a good performance mode because I know my... They've released the PC requirements for this game, and I don't think my PC can handle it, Jake. <laughs> All right, bye, Vanilla Soup. Everybody say bye, Vanilla Soup. Oh, boy. Bye, Vanilla Soup. The last immortal. Man, that actor, the main actor is so familiar. Roshanians haven't had enough yet. We yeah, haven't given that? them enough yet. Your men killed my family. Man, this is a long trailer. Turn your back on me. T Joey, tell me when you hit the title card. Okay. I'll say now when I hit it. Great. I, yeah, I got, I got power. Now. Perfect. Were you that far ahead of me or something? Yep. Dang, son. Ah, oh, July 20th. That's the day before Pikmin 4. 505 games. What are they doing? That's a big tower. Are we going to go up the Yeah. Tower? Dude, is this Judge oh, Dredd? Yeah. That'd be crazy. Oh, is that what this is? No, it's not. <laughs> okay, I don't. I immediately thought of Dread. Destiny looking Ooh. dude over here. Oh, you know what this is? This is that, um. I think it's just called Ghost Runner. 
I feel like uh, Ghost Runner. We, oh yeah. Yeah, I feel like we knew about it. Remember, remember this? I do remember Ghost Runner. I haven't played yeah. it yet. So violent. Ghost Runner II. Oh. So many II games here. Yeah. Ooh. So far, some a lot of 2023 games. I like. Yeah. That. It's black. Staying What's black your for plan? What's Knowing you have only 66 days to live. Wait, what is this? Liking how this looks. I'm liking how everything is it feels it feels alive. It feels active. Yeah. You know better than anyone else. I agree, zombie. We need a Judge Dread game done right. Oh heck yeah. I love this. In a nutshell, face. everyone wears a mask. He'll let you live. <laughs> Not everyone, sell unfortunately. Oh dang! How does this? How does this work? Bro, he's moving his hands around like crazy. How do you? Uh, yeah. What? How do you control this? I don't know. <laughs> oh, this this trailer's heating up. They know what they're doing. Take cover. Yo, this is sick. It's Running tough too because I feel like Ghost of Tsushima kind of oh, eats the lunches of these kinds of games. But they're starting to make a they're starting to make a pitch. Yeah. One last toast. The combat We're is super done. complex. Yeah. Somebody said Tenchu. Is that what this game oh, is, or is it like, uh, like they're reminding you of Tenchu? Oh. Yeah, the trailers have not been stand out yet. Unless, hopefully, PlayStation is following the rules of start slow, finish strong. I hope so. Yeah. I'm still digging it. Though. I'm digging it. Yeah. <laughs> Patience is the key master. The key master. Time is not on his side. All we have to do is wait. Yes. Another long Let's trailer. Super long. Yeah. We're Thirteen minutes in. Pay Payella says Lego Seinfeld, the complete saga. Phantom Blade Zero. What's your plan? Knowing you have only 66 days to live. Interesting. I like the premise. That's kind of cool. Get my heart days. back. You can do a yeah. lot in 66 days. Yeah. You can beat half of Tears of the Kingdom in 66 days. Oh. <laughs> Ooh, what's this? Oh, this is by those, uh, what's that studio they did, like, Pathless and Journey? Oh, it looks Definitely like that. it, dude. Uh, That Game Company. That, yeah. This is yeah. totally a That Game Company game. 100%. Yep. Told yep. ya. You told me, actually. <laughs> I didn't play all of Abzu. Have you? Well, it wasn't for me. It wasn't for me. Yeah, that was Giants. Yo, I'm feeling this though. It's a sandboarding game. Yeah. This 
skateboards and skateboard-like things underutilized in video games. I feel like that should be a genre, skateboard-like. Yeah, skateboard-like. Mm -hmm. Bro, do you gotta bring the water back to this planet? That'd be a, that's a great premise. Ooh, that's cool, that's a great idea, yeah. Giant flying whale. Sword of the Sea. Sick. Coming to PS5. Well, I would hope so. This is a PlayStation showcase, so. Yeah. Okay, show me something good, PlayStation. Show me something good. Halo Infinite. A new world <laughs> awaits you. Full of dangers and mysteries, signs and wonders. Who is this little weirdo? Things that I, in my garden, could never have imagined. Think of the world we could build if we believed in ourselves. Thomas. If we truly Arnold believed in what it means Talos to be principle. sentient. Okay. To face the universe without fear or delusion. Oh, Tom is correct. That is what this is. Yeah. Imagine vast you see a little cat stretching? Yeah. and light. Strange. That was good. <laughs> Great towers rising towards the sky. So much would be possible. Never played these games. Yeah, I don't even know what if we what the deal is. Either. If we still have faith. So many II games. What is this II? I liked that cut on the trailer though. If we still had cut faith. That I liked that. That was that was nice. <laughs> it was nice. Isn't it? It's pretty. Ooh, I'm already feeling this one. Give me a, a bicycle, please. Just die? No, no, no. Gris. He's playing. He's playing. Ooh, from the creators of Greece or Gris. No, he's dead. Oh, damn it. <laughs> Ooh, big dog. Oh, did real big. <laughs> oh, she's got a sword. The calamity. All right, this is epic. <laughs> no, not the dogs. All right, we're good. We're good. Dogs are okay. Oh no, dog no, dog no, no. Oh, Joey, why did they do this to us? Oh God, I'm gonna cry. Oh, son of a gun! We lost the dog. Oh, they're getting me with this one. They're getting me. Never. Oh no. Oh no. That's what Alfred would say to Bruce Wayne. I'm 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 oh, oh, how how do we transition out of that? Oh jeez. Cat game. That was rough to watch. Bro. Pirates of the Peruvian? You ever play one of these? No, I haven't. Yeah, I actually played Cat Quest 2 with Sarah. We had a great time. That's the trailer you follow up. The one that broke me like that. Man. Yes. Get ready to cry and now get ready to be confused. <laughs> oh, God. I'm, I'm, oh. God. 
Gotham City? No. Where at Phoenix? <laughs> Is this a quiet man too? Whoa, wait, hold on a second, fellas. What is going on? I like, I like okay. this. I like this. It's a showtime! Oh, okay. Casino Night Zone. Here we go. Those gotta be created characters. Bro, Persona music. Yo, this rips. I'm loving this. They're just attacking each other with bubbles. <laughs> Yo, this looks so fun. Oh, look, look at that. Oh, here we go. Some gameplay. Will it look as fun? Oh, a surfboard like. What is this? Some kind of power wash simulator? I don't know, but I'm loving it. Yo, it's kind of got a lot. It's kind of got some Splatoon with the different colors for the teams. Is this Splatoon? This is Bathtoon. Dude, I think Square said I'm getting some of that Splatoon money. <laughs> Ready for the Foam Star party? Foam Star? That's a name. Foam Stars. That is a name. Foam, foam Stars. Okay. I love it. Join the Foam Blasting Frenzy. I think <gasps> I will. Oh! Oh! I'm so excited! Nice. Yeah, this Welcome is awesome. to the land of Mojo. I need, I need a release John, date. The plucky squire and his Remember when we thought this was going to be in the, in the indie spotlight? And pit. Right. Our heroes oh, Ja the is such a good name for the protagonist here. Great idea. Grum. They adventure to the edges Hung of their grum. realm. And even beyond. There, Jot finds a whole new world to explore with dangers, surprises, and attractively furnished accommodation. Our heroes must battle Humgrump across the two realms if they are to save their beloved land. Man, it looks from really nice in 3D designs. and 2D. Off the page and into adventure! Still 2023. Come on, man. Yeah. That's nice. That's nice. That's going to be a good one. Oh, we got a big transition, Joey. So something's something's coming. Better. Let's see. I think it might be time. Oh, what I was is wrong. This? Minecraft? It looks like it. This is this is Minecraft. But what? Is this like a demolition game? Yo, why did this get the, the sweet PlayStation transition? Oh no, I'm a little Sony, what are you doing right now? Yeah. <laughs> I'm, a, I'm feeling that vibe a little bit. <laughs> Sony, what are you doing? Do I just have a cold heart? There is nothing about this enthusing me. Nope, me either. I, yeah, I, I don't know. Just For being like all weird and blocky, the color palette is not doing it. I know they're trying to be unique by combining like real with, with mm. like art style, but like. Okay. Oh, after credits tease, what is it? Ha! Ha! Ah. Okay. All right. 
Oh, okay. Apparently, somebody in chat says it's a port. So apparently, this is a game. Okay, it's already out. Somewhere that else. that's rough, dog. Do you like this? Is it is it cool? Does it? Are the kids on TikTok talking about it? TikTok <laughs> talking about it? About? Is this grounded or something? This would that's... be a bug's life, Joey. No, Jake. This is that Ant Man game you're talking about. Oh, finally, they listened. Yes. You play as one of his many ants and uncles. Could you imagine it's like an MMO and you're all Ant-Man's army of ants? That'd be so crazy. That would, that would rip. Uh, what is this? Is it finally that game that got canceled? I think Wild? Ubisoft was doing it. Wild, Joey. Is it back? That'd be crazy if it was. Yo, I was hyped on Wild when it got announced. We just went from ant to bird, so I feel like there's something. You know what this is, Jake? This is this is a predator game. I'm calling it. We're going up the food chain. Yes, there was a scene exactly like this in the new Predator movie, Prey. Oh, okay. This has I think to you're be a Prey. Pre they already had a Predator game on PlayStation before. Gotcha. <gasps> no! It's real. Yo, that's a good model. That's a good Yo, model. Yo, let's go! What a thrill. They're playing the theme, Jake. With darkness and silence. Metal Gear Triangle? Snake Eater? Why are they. Why are they. Okay. No, they have to be weird, Joey. They have to. It's that part was... of the identity. <laughs> Yo. Okay, so my, my buddy Alan texted me right before Snake revealed himself, went, Yo! And I'm like, oh, what's what's he talking about? Oh, wait. Oh, it's coming to... Yo! Metal Gear Solid, that's a big deal. So, like, they had the HD collection on Xbox 360 and PS3, but they didn't have the first Metal Gear Solid game on there. Got it. Okay. So that's you can great. now play the trilogy. Excellent. I mean, cool. I, I've never played those, so that's yeah, that's awesome. Wow, I feel I feel like they just snuck that in. Like it didn't get the it didn't get like a big you know. That was a good reveal. Man, that 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 character, that face model, that was nice. That was a nice face model. It was striking. It was it was striking. Yeah, it was cool. I don't know what this looks like the game you were just talking about wild. Yeah, this is wild. This is wild. <laughs> it's, it's, not back, Ubi, it's not from Ubisoft though. It's from okay. Oh, and it's a it's a town thing oh. I mean, oh Alan said yo, I just Took a massive poop watching that trailer. We're eating good. <laughs> we're getting one two and three Heck yeah, oh, Alan we got some uh, Zelda, some uh, paraglide, and riding a little little creature. Love that. Swimming in the ocean. Heck yeah. That was a good. I can't get over that reveal. Okay. Oh, and we're gliding. Yep. No, okay. I, this is kind of winning me over at it now. I'm kind of into it. So it's like a base builder, and it's a adventure game. Yeah. Oh, we're diving. Carlos, don't be so bitter. No, stop it. Carlos in the chat saying, I don't know, guys, a full minute of nothing but ominous camera movements to only reveal a face and a title. Yeah, no, the come on, Carlos. Don't be so stupid. Uh, no, I'm I'm kinda with you, Carlos. As Stop somebody it, that's Jake. not in on in on the franchise, the I don't I don't get it, friends. but I feel like for the fans, you that's all you need us. to see. We'd help you if we could. Final Fantasy 16. Uh, I think Assassin's Creed. We no, it's Final Fantasy 16. Oh, okay, you're right. I just saw the square logo. <laughs> I'm, I'm a little bit ahead of you, but I'll try not to be oh, okay. spoilery. I'm on like a second or two you ahead of you. That's what, yeah, yeah, yeah. I think, I think it was just fun predicting like what that trailer was going to be. It, yeah, I hear you. Yeah. 
I was just like, oh, yeah, it's Ant Man. Oh, it's um, Wild. Oh, it's the Predator. I, I was convinced it was a Predator game, and then like, oh, oh man, I'm so about this game's combat. I, yeah. I was. I feel like some of the previews were saying that the performance was maybe not there, though. So I'm, I've got some. It's, you know, it's that still was, in progress. It's still, right, right. they like optimized. They like optimize games until like the very last second. So yeah, we'll see. I don't know, it's coming out in June next month, so yeah. you might be onto something. Do you believe what I'm Oh, uh, this speaks to me though. This is this is kinda what I want from Final Fantasy. You do it by choice. They don't believe in me. They believe in the powers of dominant. You can't blame a man for wanting to bring an end to all this, can you? Yo, that voice actor, I swear I know who that is. I, I think he is he was in that movie The Witch. Have you seen that? No. Okay. He's, he's, a, he's like a he's a film actor. He's got a really raspy voice. Come to me, Like it or lock it, Jake. Are we getting a demo today, or at least a demo reveal? Um. Yes, lock it. Enough of this. I use my talents to my advantage. You would tell me there is shame in that? Oh, this looks awesome. I would be the king of the world! Darkness has taken hold of you. It has made you forget yourself. Shout out to Vera Blue. We have to kill life. chaos. Have to stop him. Hey, I, I, you know, I kind of like that game. I, I don't even know anything about it. I just know the meme. <laughs> it's kind of a good time, actually. I, yeah, I like yeah, I didn't hear anything bad about it. A lot of cool, like, different uh, classes you could do that really change the combat, like, depending on what kind of weapons you wanted to use. It was fun. Nice. Yeah. Why is everyone saying Crash Bandicoot? I don't know. A lot of Crash in our chat, yeah. Are they just watching the Twitch stream and telling us what's going on? That'd be funny. Yeah, that'd be hilarious. Final Fantasy 16! Uh, man, I want maximum drama in games like this, and I saw a lot of people being like, ah, you know, and that's all I want. That's what I want from these kinds of games. Oh, no, no demo. No demo. Say no to the demo. I thought we were getting there. Yo, did you hear that? What? That. Da, da, da. Yeah, I heard that. Is that supposed to be anything, or do you just... I don't know, but I, I liked it. <laughs> I was like, is it hinting at something, Jake? They're being, they're being freaks this time around. Yes. <laughs> I'm trapped here. In this nightmare. Ooh. Yo, Alan this. Wake 2! To nice. Every word is a step forward. That voice is just immediately recognizable to me. Cool. <gasps> this is the first time we're getting gameplay. The darkness. Okay. So, everybody, shut up. I'm glad you're on this case with me, Anderson. It's right up your alley. Dude, is that Max Payne's voice? The victim was one of their own. Yo. FBI Special Agent Robert Nightingale. Oh, that'd be cool. Because so you knew they Albert. hinted at Only the character the Robert Nightingale being like a Max Payne a thing. Mm. Someone knew they were here. Yo, let's go. With them. Jake, I have waited Kill for the sequel to this game since message. I was 15 years old. It's for us. Yo, why is this trailer so good? This the trailer's is killing about us. Cinematic. By the way, that's we that's Max Payne the totally. Story. That's mm. the horror story wanted us dead. That's the same facial actor they made for Max Payne. So he's supposed to be Max Payne, pretty much. Got it. And you're not playing as Alan right now. What? I love this. Oh, there's my something. God. I'm forgetting. There's something important. Oh my God! I love Jake. Something's not right. You know right. how I excited I am for Metroid Prime Four? This mm -hmm. is like my second most anticipated game of all time. First things first. What's your name? Alan Wake to <laughs> October seventeenth. Yes. My, My name dreams. is Alan Wake too. <laughs> Alan Wake, I, I, I know Lucas. I hear the one talking. I was kidding about everybody shutting up. Like there was no way. <laughs> oh, here we go. I'm excited for this. First, first gameplay reveal. Cool. Welcome, hidden one. This is like they're finally going back to like Assassin's Creed's roots in this, mm -hmm. like gameplay wise. You have died. Oh, I need to rewatch that Alan Wake 2 trailer, dude. Like that was hype. Oh man, this looks this look visually I'm digging this actually. Yes. 
Cool. And you're like actually like going through like city streets this time. There was in the last yeah. few Assassin's Creed games, there's a lot of open world like out in the field stuff, but here it's right. Like, we need to find a way to get you inside without being seen. You could bribe the guards to look the other way. Fun fact: the I actor who plays the main Bessie. character is mm -hmm. Agent Stone in the Sonic movies. Oh, cool! Yeah, I think his name's Leave a Jew. All right, things are ramping up now in this showcase. Uh, yeah, just show me Alan Wake. Show me Metal Gear Solid 3. I'm hooked. And let's go. Huh. I always appreciate that 60 FPS frame rate. Yeah. The stage is yours, Basim. We will be watching. Nice. When's it coming out, though? October 12th. Oh, that's a good week for me. Assassin's Creed and <laughs> Alan Wake too, dude. Like, I'm kind of surprised at this. Maybe people already knew, but I feel like I hadn't, wasn't even on my radar. Assassin's Creed. Yeah, that release releasing this year. Yeah, that was. Yeah, that, we didn't even know a date for that game yet. Oh, it's uh, Night in the Woods. <laughs> if this is called Night in the Woods, I I, I will be very happy. <laughs> Pixel Ghost says, does the cat die, though? No, stop. <laughs> Jamie says, don't think we're getting Starman 2 today. Oh, we are. 100%. Oh, stop it. Stop it. Yeah, 100%. Revenant Hill. I I'm Same developer, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> yeah, it's almost like the cat was just like a reference. Yeah. I'm man, that was talk about getting nothing out of a trailer, man. I love this comment. Pixel Lord says Assassin's Creed Marge. <laughs> Homie, we have to assassinate the <laughs> No. <laughs> Ooh. Is this Genshin Impact? No. No. No, it looks too good. <laughs> yeah. I'm digging it though. Yeah, yeah, this is neat. Got some party members, got some different weapons. Yo, this is cool. Yeah, <laughs> nice. Nice. You don't announce your attacks before you do them, dude. Classic video game mistake. I know I'm in the minority here, but if they tell me that this is like a multiplayer game and all of these characters were created, they're not like just party members in a single player game, that would give me hype. We shall see. Grand Blue Fantasy. Oh my god, I almost said this, Joey, and I didn't want to seem like an idiot. I was like, I thought I thought it was Grand Blue, but in my head that was like a Nintendo thing. I don't know why I thought that. Oh, Street Fighter 6! I don't even know Ooh. I didn't even know what Grand Blue was, course, Jake, so you wouldn't. They had that mobile game that true strength. I don't know. Yeah. I'm not I'm not up to date I'm on mobile games. My share of enemies. I had to All right, overcome. is this where they reveal a Fire Emblem character is coming to Street Fighter? My journey knows Ooh. no end. I will continue to do what I have always done. Your story starts oh. here. Hey, I love when that, you man. You said you were seeking strength, despite having no real need to do so. Honestly, I thought you were a complete Oh my god, idiot. training with Zangief, that's awesome. Masters, Remember when Zangief was in Wreck-It Ralph? Yes. I need to crush him to see him die. To chase after a monster like that. Wait, can I get that Blanca costume, please? It's 
probably worth looking into this nice shawl business. I want to know how he gets his hair like that. Ah, uh, he rules. How I seem to be the Satsui no Hado. Was it simply a trick of the senses? I hope we don't get a copyright claim on this. Bison. It, it bothers me so much that the avatars you make don't really have access to the same kind of cartoony style that all the characters in the world do. Yeah. So they look so much cooler, and your avatar is just like a person. This journey doesn't have a real ending. Street Fighter Six. Street Fighter says. I was gonna say I feel like they have nothing left to reveal. I was like, there's, they're just gonna. Right. It's just a trailer. But you can get special titles and stickers. Come on, Jay. Oh, yeah. Now, here's... Okay, now, listen. PlayStation, Sony, they bought Evo. So I feel like they got to do a little bit of just fighting game lip service. All right. Man, I love Street Fighter VI. So excited. That's going to be fun. Get excited. Street Fighter? Anybody in the chat hype for Street Fighter? Oh, Robert Gomez. Heck yeah. This looks interesting. Yeah. Is it a Metroidvania? Because I'll be all over it. It has that kind of flavor, I, I, I hear you. I think Hollow Knight fans have played this before Silk Song comes out in 2027. Yeah, it gives me Guacamelee vibes too, Mage. I, I, I almost thought that as well. Oh, is it yeah. the Guacamelee devs? I don't know. I don't think. Yeah. Did we see a Drinkbox Studios logo at the beginning of this? I don't, I don't think know. so. Ultros. Twenty twenty four. Who developed it though? I didn't see the logos. Oh well. Yeah. My own fault, probably, if it was in the trailer. All right, we got twenty eighteen minutes left. About. All right, time. It's time. It's time to start bringing out big boys. Bring I out the big I boys. Hey, we're gonna start hitting big boy rhythm now. They uh, gave me Alan Wake 2. I'm satisfied. Alright, let's see. It's a mech game. Damon X Machina? So, um, so this developer, they're a Chinese developer that does, like, really big scale games and, like, MMOs. This is the Genshin Impact devs, isn't it? No. Because it looks like it. I, get, I swear, this one actually looks like Genshin Impact to me. Yeah, you're right. I think the audio is out of sync. Oh. Oh, I do, I do like being in that big, that big chub, chubster mix. That was cool. I could have sworn the Genshin Impact devs were working on something like this. I feel like we would see, like, Mihoyo or whatever their oh, thing yeah, is. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, wow. Breath of Tears of the Kingdom couldn't even get ex underwater exploration. Tower of this fantasy. looks pretty nice. That that was the nicest looking thing they showed, actually. <laughs> yeah, so they didn't show more of it. Yeah. What's this? This. We're flying uh We're flying that uh, Last Guardian back. Capcom. Oh, is this uh below? Deep down. Deep no, down. Sorry Jake, about that. You know what Deep this down. is? No. Stop. <laughs> No, dude! Oh, man! I can't believe this! Nobody warned me! <laughs> Look at it! Look how good it looks! Oh my god, they gave them money. This is gonna be unstoppable. This is, this is the RPG. Oh my god. I'm so happy for you. 
Oh my god, they're doing the crazy big magic that everybody loved from the first one. So sick. I can't believe how good this looks. I was expecting this game to come out and look like fun, if I'm being honest. So this is amazing. <laughs> Okay, grabbing onto the enemies while they're like trying to fly away, doing attacks on them. Classic Dragon's Dogma mechanic. Uh, sick to see it return. Oh, they haven't talked about PSVR 2 games. See, Robin. Oh, said. good point. But it doth not Carlos says, I don't see dogs in this dogma. I'm like, y'all need to go to school so you know what dogma is. Come on. <laughs> I'm just kidding, Carlos. Dragon's Dogma 1, you can pick it up on the Switch right now for like $5. It's, ama it, it, it's well, amazing. For Love playing it. Oh, PSVR. And minimal social interaction. Oh, that looked so good. You know oh my god, Dragon's Dogma 2. To find a place where you feel that you truly belong. And to find a job that treats you mostly is this with Five respect, Nights at Freddy's? And only infrequently with I could have sworn I saw Five Nights at Freddy's reason, poster. We were excited Good to call. inform you that you did an adequate enough job the first time around to have you back. This is definitely FNAF, yep. Sister location. Also, there were no other applicants. So strap yourself in and get motivated to an appropriate degree. Just show me Half-Life Alex. Because you ain't excited. seen nothing yet. Oh. The name Dragon's Dogma didn't even enter into my brain the whole time I was thinking about this. <laughs> right. Al 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 two. One. Okay. <laughs> ah, scary! <laughs> I'm so scared. It's doing me a frighten. Okay. Now we're doing big boys. PSVR 2, big boys. Excellent. Excellent. That's what I want to see. Show me the goods. Oh. Resident Evil 4 VR. Awesome. Yes. Awesome. Mark, you've gone. Dude, you're supposed to brush them out of the way with your VR hit controller. Come on, dude. <laughs> That's what I, I haven't done the tutorial yet. <laughs> I still have never played Resident Evil 4. This might this might be it for me. This might be the way. You didn't even play Resident Evil 8 until it came on VR, did you? No. Nice. I like to RE8 VR. I just need to see him shooting a gun. I need to see it. Okay, here we go. Oh, so that's like the parry. That's like a new move, right? Yeah. Cool. Okay. That, that manual reload, love to see it. VR mode. Heck yes. In development. We're not seeing it for a while. Uh, probably next year, I think. Dang. Man, Capcom, they're producing out here. Oh, Vertigo games. Forgive me, Father. For I've sinned. Like, a lot. You I see, feel like a lot of video game voice actors are years doing ago, a Troy Baker impression. I met Fred. Sad, right? Oh, is this Arizona sunshine? Ever since then, it's like I see his face everywhere. And lately, I've started to develop some destructive tendencies. Whoosh! Yeah, this has what to be Arizona sunshine. Here? It's a very popular oh, a VR a zombie spot. game. Hello, ugly. Cool. Blah, 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 blah. And since I met my new best friend, I guess I get a little. Uh, Fair Blue says Nacho Libre VR. He does kind of. Yeah, Jack Black. Okay, very overprotective. Ew. I'd love to sit here there all day. There are children watching this stream. Off. Whoa, that was intense. I'll be right out, boy. <laughs> but as you know, time waits for no man. Catch you later, Fred. <laughs> Who's a good boy? Man, that man was really casual with that grenade. I, I, yeah. Woo, looks <laughs> like today's gonna be a scorcher. Another II game. How many II games have we seen in this showcase? A lot of yeah. Half-Life Alex. All come right. on. If I see the Valve logo, I will scream. 
I gotta say that this this is not inspiring a lot of PSVR2 content. No, it's not at all. I I thought they'd have a, a heavy hitter. This is giving me the sense that they do not. Now, is this the Firewall Ultra game? I don't know. I don't, it doesn't. It doesn't seem like it. No, I don't think so. Yeah. This looks like VR Call of Duty. There's something very specific about it that I think Call of Duty. Alright, bye Bradley. Everybody say goodbye to Bradley. Cross goodbye fire Bradley. Layers. Um... Cross oh, okay. Crossfire, that's a thing. Yeah, it's okay. not a good game. Crossfire X got right, destroyed when it came out. Okay, Joey, now we're doing the big hitters. boys. Yeah. Target is Colonel Peter Conrad. He was one of ours before he went rogue. This sounds familiar. We intercepted it does sound familiar. To neurosynaptic tech. That's Jennifer Hale dark. talking. I'm pretty sure. Mm. I don't have to remind you what's at stake here. Is this we'll Hitman VR? Intel by no, any it's not. Means necessary. Mm. He's connected to a mind synchronization device. This is cutting edge interrogation tech. We're out of time and out of options. I feel like this is linked to some franchise. I could be wrong. Mm -hmm. Ah, yet another lamb to the slaughter. Well, come on then. Is Let's that? see what you're made of. <laughs> that sounded like Solid Snake. <laughs> the voice actor plays him. Right. We actually saw this game before, didn't we? Yes, yes we, we did. did. We did. Play. Huh. I, I still think this looks cool. I was yeah. I liked it the first time too. My war. But again, it doesn't inspire a lot of confidence. That guy because... talking is Snake. That's so funny. I need you to oh, cool. That's Snake's Clock voice actor. You have to adapt. We have Man, nine there minutes are, left of this showcase. And they're recycling old things that have already been in presentation. You're getting close. You're approaching the center of his subconscious. You think you're a threat to me? Like, listen, I will play this. This this seems extremely up my alley. But. Yeah. July, it's coming out on 4th of July, Jake, and know what you're doing. Cool. You're God doing? bless Synapse. <laughs> oh, Beat Saber, of course. Why did why did this not come out on launch day? That's my what I'm wondering. Yeah. And here comes the copyright claims. Yeah, for real. <laughs> Quick talk over Queen. Um, yeah, this this showcase so far, um, it's fine. It's not. Dude, did like, you turn the audio off? I couldn't do that. I forgot I could do that. Oh God. <laughs> yeah, this this showcase so far has been fine. Some really good announcements, but it's not. I know a lot of people are. Um, oh, Queen music pack. Okay. But I know. A lot so of it's available now. It said Beat Saber Two. Oh, what? Cool. Yeah, that's cool. Shadow Drop Beat Saber 2. All about that. I think it's too late now, right? Yeah, we probably got that copyright claim already. <laughs> All right, seven minutes left, Joey. Now we're doing only <laughs> big boys. Mushrooms. The Last of Us. Just nah, it's it's, it's going to be something else. Is this Division or something? It's it, Yo, I also got that feeling immediately. I was like, this is Ubisoft. Like, the vibe. Yeah. What's that? Oh, it's What's Bungie. that? What? Hold my the... my interest is peaked. Is my this... interest is peaked. Is this is this Destiny or is it like a new IP? It looks like something new. Wait a second, Bungie now. Give me something, Bungie. Give me something. I'm not digging the style of this game, the art style. I kind of like it. It's I too like colorful. It. Like, it's obnoxiously colorful. Oh.
Yo, what happened to that moon, for real? It's called Marathon. Okay. Uh, I needed more. I needed more. Yeah. Like, I'm not... It's fine, I guess. My Bungie making a new shooter. Cool. Oh, what? There's more? Are we moving to Destiny now? This is Destiny music. Okay. Okay. I, I, I presume this is just like a new tra trailer for their new season. Yeah. You've missed so much. We've slain gods. Vanquished nightmares. Fought alongside those who we once fought against. Oh, heck yeah. I wish you could have been there. Yo, is it, is it, uh... Yeah, me too, kiddo. It's the guy. But hey. I'm oh, he's now. back, dude. I thought he died. Yeah, he died. Where the hell here is. Nathan Fillion's back, everybody. Cade, Cade 6. The final shape. And then Destiny 3's coming. Destiny Showcase coming August 22nd. Okay, cool, I guess. Wow, that's cool. That's So that's like their, their final thing before Destiny 2's over. Nice. Firewalk is the developer. I don't know what they did. Joey, there's four minutes left. Got to impress. Ten seconds. Five, four, three, three Here we go. What was that? Was that it? I don't know. I am I so know. excited for nothing. Chat, what is going on? Somebody throw me a life vest. I'm freaking out. This is a this is a huge L. This is not good, chat. I'm I'm bugging. Oh, movie time, Gran Turismo. Gran Turismo. Perfect. Players. Just what I oh, wanted. Oh, we'll compete. God, this is a train wreck. Did we just forget how to do video game presentations? Sony, this is flop. This is flop era. This, man, I'm I'm blown away right now. At least show me Alan Wake 2 last, and I'd call this a good conference. <laughs> My rigatoni. I agree, Jake. This is rough. I take back the bias comment completely. Uh, this is uh, it's 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 more than rough. I'm I'm severely disappointed. Oh God. Yo, they're showing us a commercial for a movie right now. Yeah. Cool. I guess. Two minutes left. But like, but that's the thing. It's like I don't even. Uh, my hype is already deflated for Spider-Man because I feel like it's so little time now that it's just going to be like. Thank you for joining us today. Look how sweet these puddles. Before look. we get into our final game, I have a few announcements to share. At PlayStation, innovation is our passion, and that applies to not just what games you play but how you play them. Later this year, we will launch a dedicated Yo, device that, that enables you to stream any game from your PS5 oh my console God, using remote play real. or Wi-Fi. Internally known I as want Project it. I want Q, it, Joey. It has an eight inch HD screen. But it's for oh, it looks streaming. So, it looks so no. stupid. DualSense wireless controller. It's for streaming. I don't like that. I like a remote play we look device. To I like a remote more play. Information yeah, but in the near it's like, future. Can't take I'm it also anywhere. pleased to reveal our first ever PlayStation. That's not the form factor I would have gone. With. Next generation audio immersion oh, to yay, PS5 PlayStation earbuds. and PC. They simultaneously connect to smartphones. Oh, New that's wireless a sick technology case, will deliver lossless audio with low latency, giving you outstanding sound That's kind of cool. That's kind of neat. While you're playing. Look out for more details soon. We hope okay. today's showcase demonstrates our oh, continued I'm, commitment. I, 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 I like that handheld, honestly. That surprise and Sorry. delight our players. I <laughs> want to thank all of you for your unwavering support for PlayStation. Okay, Spider-Man time. 
or not. I like when, you know, my fiance is watching something. I got my little remote play handheld doing, grinding out some trophies. All about it. Wait, is there really not going to be Spider-Man, dude? Or is, is that, that Craven? Sam Witwer? <laughs> that is, yes. Did you say is that Sam Witwer? You might be onto something. It kind of looks like him. Yeah, that's Craven, isn't it? You gotta be. You grow slow in your old age, Sergei. Who's Sergei? A fate you will not share. Oh, that's totally crazy. Oh, it's his son. I've been in your shadow for hours, but you sense nothing. Pathetic. I asked for an equal, and this is what you find. Sir, perhaps a new hunting ground. New York City. Of course. Light the fires. The great hunt begins. Is this all they're gonna show of Spider-Man? No gameplay? The game's supposed to come out this year, but I guess not anymore. Oh man, I'm, they, they've got to show something, Joey. Yeah. I'm, I'm, a, I'm, okay. I'm about to have maximum soul. Okay, it's not over, Jake. Okay, all right. This is sighted in Queens, closing in now. Yeah, Carlos, I'm begging them for some gameplay too. I'm seeing a step up visually. I am. The yeah, I do too. This de definitely looks in engine. I don't think it's CGI. Yeah. Oh, what? You have no idea. He's got it, dude. He's got it. He's got the symbiote. There we go. Let's go. UI is really cool looking. Yeah. Joey, they did it. They changed it. No gadget menu. Oh, nice. Craven wants to hunt. I'll give him one he'll never forget. Spider-Man is trying to kill him. Yeah, he's he's. This is intense. This is emo Parker. That is nice. Oh, oh, oh. Cool. Wow, I can't believe they fixed the thing I described to you as the Spider Man problem. Across the river. That's amazing. I'm not gonna make it in time. Switch to Miles! Miles, the hunters track Connors to the Harlem fish market. Lizard. That's cool. I'm on it. Sounds like Craven's checking off his. We don't have much time. Move. Uh, guess we'll chat later. Whoa, speed. Speed increase. Genki, the lizard's Dude, loose glide, at the fish market. Must Yo, you this is something. You weren't able to do that in Miles Morales, were really you? Tough hiding no, of course mom, not, no. Yeah, I'll boot up and see you there. They got here fast. Can't let him find Connors, or he's done for. Okay, so they're trying to find Dr. Kurt Connors, who we okay, know. Okay, Miles has the same UI too, so they actually did get rid of that menu I didn't like. That's amazing. Spread out. Yeah, looking for Kurt Connors, so I guess he's the lizard now. Mm. Uh, create your own zip lines. Look at those fish. We might connect them to other zip lines. Perch, take down them, Miles. Do it. Yes, yeah, the most quiet takedown ever, just butting people's bodies together. Wow, we also talked about this, creating your own persistent web things. Yeah. So, how's the hunt going? Watch out, 
We should develop video games, Jake. Let's do it. Dude, I'm in. I'm having all the good ideas. Wow, they're they're really going in on his electricity stuff. Right. Yes. It's electric. You, Connors? Mm, that ray tracing. Garage, I think. Ringtone. I don't know. Those are probably three. I don't know. <laughs> Very dark. Connor's yes, that rough stock, that is blood. He's out of control. No thanks, really no name says. How new mm -hmm. No thanks, no name says Batman Arkham games were better. And I'm like, yes, they were. But <laughs> I'm really impressed with how new this looks. It's yeah. it's like like much bigger than the difference between God of War and Ragnarok. I feel like this this feels like a completely new thing. Yep, it's only coming to PS5 too, so that's always nice. Yeah. Where am I now? You're in the cafeteria, kiddo. <laughs> How'd you find me? Follow the fish. Drones picking up lizard's trail. He's still eating. Who's that? We can On catch him off guard. Calm. Is that Harry? Yankee, get behind me. Yankee! It's just his skin. Doesn't that mean he's getting bigger? Hungrier, too. Oh, it's just fish blood. It doesn't count. <laughs> it's just Peter. Whoa. Nice. Hey man. New threads? The building's swarming with hunters. Any sign of Connors? Uh, yeah. Genki's tracking him. Hey, Mr. Parker. Mr. Spider-Man, I mean. Uh, but the date is incomplete. Okay, I think I got a lock. Genki, wait, be chill. That wasn't me. Me neither. I don't even have a stomach, so... Let's go! Get the lizard. Lizard time. Go, go, go! Take him alive! I was like, was that green arrow? But I forgot what <laughs> first we were in. Can't lose Connors. Harry's dying, and he's the only one who can help. We How won't. convenient of them to, the to like, the jet skis. have all that, all those cranes. <laughs> hey, you guys think maybe we should stop driving where there are cranes for them to swing on? Nah. Really exciting. Keep it tight, man. Watch out for those drones. Don't worry. They think I'm a friendly. Spider-Man! The East River is not a river, but in fact a saltwater tidal flat. Spider-Man is fighting on right now! Everybody get out! Those poor civilians. Oh no, people died, definitely. Help the tour boat! Right, I've got the metal murder bird! I warned you about going after Connors. Now this is on you. Oh man, Peter is mad. This this voice work is uh so, is something. Well, you don't like it? He's doing a weird. I've got the venom in me right now. It's also kind of grunting because he's swinging too. Okay. I don't know, Joey. I think he's doing a. Well, yeah, he's supposed to be pissed off. No, no, no. He's, Spider Man he's is got back. The, like you said, he's got he the symbiote in. Yeah. Oh, no. It's it's corny. It's a little corny. I mean, Spider -Man, it's Spider Man. The Spider Man yeah. himself is corny. He gets bit by a radioactive spider and, like. Yeah. Over there. Go over to Kendrick. Move, move, move. Uh, the Meg too. Miles, grab on, let's go. Yeah. <laughs> 
Oh yeah, jet skiing minigame. This is the weirdest gameplay sequence. I love it. This is it. it <laughs> I do not want to be lizard food. Wow, they've we've we're somehow playing Ratchet and Clank right now with a Spider-Man skin. <laughs> Same That's developers, dead, man. Now. Show me what it looks can't like. Get in close enough. I can't. I can't with the Spider-Man voice. Remember? It's awful. That's it. Oh God, that's how we're representing Ellie, Venom as somebody Fuck. just talking like this. Like, oh my God. I think you're being a little too nitpicky right now, One, Jake. Let's be not, real. not at all, Joey. It's every line. Oh, yes, they saved the one guy and just threw him to the ground. He got away from us. It's good, Pete. I saved the tracker. Let's go, man, before he gets too far. No. I just want you to know, Jake, the chat agrees with He's me. Fine. You are being very nitpicky. Are you sure? Oh, that's fine. <laughs> I don't <laughs> mind. So do I. So do I. Um, he's not At least he's not doing like the Batman that, voice. Right? No. He's never like that. He sounds way less raspy. <laughs> no, some some people in chat are on my side. Okay, good for you. I've got I've got some people. Yeah. Yeah. Most people oh, he's a good. Ha 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 ha. To be greater together. When's it coming out? Fall. Okay. The fall's not that far from now, so we should get cool. a date soon. And there you go. There's your reminder of what console you're playing these games on. All right. Let's go over. I don't have too much time. Oh, fun fact about that Bungie game. That was actually the... It's like a reboot of the first game Bungie ever made. Oh, all right. Yeah. Vanilla Soup texted me that. But yeah, that was certainly a showcase worth waiting Wait, two years you, for. Wait, do you not have the, the montage? Uh, I have it too, but I don't feel like talking over it. I mean, I feel I don't oh, feel okay. like watching it because it's just a montage. So I just turned okay. the volume down. Um, yeah. Um, oh, there's the... Yeah, the, the accessibility controller, and the that, handheld. Yeah. Uh, Jake, this was not great. I'm going to be real. <laughs> no, this was a pretty bad showcase. Uh, it should have just been a state of play focused on Spider-Man. Uh, I, I don't know. Like, there's cool stuff here. Those games were fine. But it didn't... Uh, the pacing of it was weird. The caliber of the announcements was weird. I don't want to discount some games here that like look right. cool or interesting. Like Alan Wake I, Two, I, is super hype for me, right? Like I've been yeah. waiting for this game for a very long time. That said, the showcase overall was still not great, and especially the, since this was yeah. the first one in two years. The PSVR Two showing was abysmal. Uh, yeah. We already knew Resident Evil Evil Four was getting that VR mode, so that wasn't really like a new announcement or anything. And uh, the other game we had already seen before, so it kind of feels like they have nothing to show, which doesn't feel good. Uh, the Bungie game announcement is like a non-announcement. That wasn't that game's that not was real. Nothing. Until we see more of it. Yeah, nothing. especially for from Bungie, who I think has a has a weight to them, could really come out and impress. To show that game that way was was a huge mistake. Uh, and I also thought that the Spider-Man segment dragged. It did. And it was way yeah, too long. I, I, the the beginning section with like the hunter doing that whole thing that was cool for like 10 seconds i don't know if i needed that whole scene uh and then i feel like the whole middle of the spider-man section like the best part was seeing peter do the venom combat section yeah at the very beginning and then the rest of it i was kind of like whatever on it was like all right yeah i kind of i get how this game works it's Same. it's fine yeah yeah it really uh, wasn't that great yeah. and it's just like like out of all the big Sony franchises we see, we've seen. Like I was hoping we'd see more of those. Like you know, your Ratchet and Clanks, your mm -hmm. like not God of Wars, but like I'm just naming examples. Like because PlayStation has these big IPs, 
And right now we're only looking forward to like one and that's Spider-Man. So like, I don't know. I feel like after two years since the last showcase, they'd have more to show. But a lot of what they showed, like, it was mostly third party stuff, it seemed. Like, I, I've, I know we've seen the PlayStation Studios logos at the beginning of them, but it's so hard to keep track of like how many. I don't want to discount like original IPs, right? But I feel like mm -hmm. when you have a showcase, you should still like you know have those well-known games in there like those big deals and they didn't really have that you know and i think a lot of people had their expectations super high too which i guess like you know hyper responsibly and whatnot but i don't blame them it's been two years since the last playstation showcase you'd think they'd be building up to something massive and it wasn't that massive it's yeah it's almost i i can almost see what's go i can almost see what's going on here which is that they're taking i think what is the new trend in video game marketing approach which is you really kind of just talk about whatever your next big release is and then everything else you wait you wait we're only gonna really talk about our big spider-man game we'll get that out and then we'll talk about whatever the next single game is until that's out and I get that, but like you said, PlayStation Showcase, I wanted to see the PlayStation brand identity. And we didn't get any of that here, and I feel like the way they went about doing those announcements sucked. Yeah. The, the, the way that they introduced that like Metal Gear Solid announcement like made it seem not as hype as it was mm -hmm. like getting that collection is really cool that new, that new uh, remake or whatever it is being announced, that's really cool. Uh, but like it just being in the middle of all of those trailers made it made it not like have any impact. I get that totally. Um, yeah, overall, like I don't have too much time to talk too much about this. I gotta head out soon. Okay. But basically, yeah, the showcase was it was a disappointment, and I hope like this summer game fest thing has better shows ahead of itself. But um, yeah, still some cool stuff in here. But like I don't know, some some stuff could have been an email, <laughs> like the yeah. like the bungee yeah. game, uh, the. There was one game I totally forgot about because it was just CGI of plants and then, like, space. Like, what was... The fact that I don't remember what it is goes to show how bad of a trailer that was. The And to give you an idea, the uh, so th Sony has put uh, the, the Spider-Man trailers on YouTube now. And that... Uh, the gameplay, just the gameplay, so from, like, the stuff introducing New York on is uh, over 10 minutes long. Yeah. And... Like, this should have just been a state of play. Should have just been Spider-Man, state of play. It, like, we, we got caught up in a little bit of that E3 energy. It did not deliver. We're not nitpicking. We're not nitpicking. This was weak. This, yeah. I feel like we don't even know that much more that we knew going in. I agree. But also, yeah. I'll leave you all with this. By Alan Wake 2. Just by Bye Alan Wake 2. That trailer oh. looked good. And uh, Spider-Man gameplay, last thing I want to say, looks really nice. I've been whining to everybody that will listen for the past couple of years that I feel like uh, having to go to a quick menu that pauses time so I can select a gadget, a web gadget, does not make me, quote-unquote, feel like Spider-Man. And I always thought that was a weird thing that everybody just passed over in favor of that game. So to see that, what seems to be wholly eliminated here in favor of trying to keep you in the flow of combat reacting using those l1 r1 buttons uh that is that like makes me so happy and that small change says a lot to me about the way that they said we're not just going to rest on our laurels of what was a really good well-received spider-man game and give you new levels new enemies we're gonna re-examine we're gonna check you know everybody loved the swinging nobody expected those uh flight suits that looked yeah. really cool too. So so having stuff like that, that inspired a lot of confidence. I'm really excited for Spider-Man 2. It looks great. Yeah, it's gonna be great. Insomniac's like yeah. one of the best. Absolutely. One but, of the best. Uh, let us know in the comments how y'all thought about the PlayStation Showcase. And uh hopefully we'll see y'all around for more uh game streams this during this summer game fest. And then not a great start, but hopefully it's hopefully it gets better from here. Um until next time everyone, bye bye.